And then shortly after, I'm like, damn, I guess people can just say anything and people will believe it. The, de- the next day, the next day, they try to accuse me of being a pedophile and write a 40-page fucking document. <laughs> a 40-page document on why I'm a pedophile. <laughs> and I shit you not, bro. I shit you not. All of this happened in one week. One week. This all happened. Like, dude. (laughs) Like, I don't know what it was. Like, maybe this. Okay. So, okay. The whole pasta ramen beef. That was bound to happen eventually, but I think it's the way I worded it that promoted more, uh, because, like, the whole pedophile one was kind of done by, like, younger people and um, what stuff like that. Oh, and don't get me started on the fact that I might have almost gotten, like, swatted and, like, doxxed and they were trying to get into my account. That's crazy as fuck, dude. All this in a week. Like, there's th- there'll never be another type of programmer. Anyway, um, so... <laughs> I think I think it might be like my fault because um on when I when I was doing the pasta ramen when I did the pasta ramen uh beef or whatever I said oh you know like his extortion thing kind of worked you know like I didn't want him to say more shit about me so I like kind of gave into what he wanted for a bit so like I'm assuming that like some like the gr- next group was like watching my stream and like hmm Maybe we can extort him and get away with saying anything. <laughs> but I should have told them that, like, obviously that was in the past, you know, like years ago. Like, obviously I was coming at Mr. Pasta Ramen because I wasn't scared of those things anymore. And I was willing to take them on. But, uh, dude, that's, I don't know. Like, I felt like I just had to stream and just, like, talk about it. Like, I don't, like, like... I don't know what the fuck. Like, don't get me wrong. If the SWAT team came to my house, I would have dealt with them. Like, I'm a part of the X Men. Like, they don't. I'm not a mutant for no reason. But like, fucking hell, dude. <laughs> so your career is over? No, 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 no. Definitely not. Everyone's on my side. We we opened up um we opened up a Discord call, dude. I opened up a Discord and I promoted it as a permanent server. So everyone joined. It was, that's kind of ratty of me to do. <laughs> I feel kind of bad. But I was like, oh, yeah, guys, we're making a permanent server. And we, I think the call max, dude, we had a call max. I, someone told me that there was 900 people at one point. I don't know if that's true, but I think we had 900 people in one Discord call. Maybe it was 850, but someone told me 900. But it was, it was getting up. There's like 850 through 900 people. Just listen to me, like, talk about my story. And, like, dude, I've just, like, (laughs) you know, sometimes I question if I'm still relevant. And then, like, (laughs) that kind of shit just happens. I'm, like, holy fuck, dude. (laughs) Like, (laughs) like, oh, my God. And so I just, dude, I just can't believe it. Like, the thing that makes me, like, the most mad. Yeah, someone's saying they saw more than 1,903. Crazy as fuck, man. But the thing that's craziest to me is, like, I literally said on stream to, like, 500 people. I was like, hey, you know, people can kind of say anything about me and they'll believe it. And then the next day, people just start saying anything they want about me and people believe it. <laughs> the next day, bro. No, I, I can't even make that up. Like, the next day. <laughs> like, it happened. So... I, I don't think people will keep believing it anymore. Like, dude, people are making up crazy shit now. They're like, uh, Seth's trying to dox this guy. Uh, uh, Seth has uh, videos of uh, 12-year-old scissoring on his phone. or Some weird shit. Like, trying to spread this crazy-ass shit. And they're, I'm just like, I do not know who these people I'm apparently doxing are. I've never even heard of them. Uh, I have no interest in this community, obviously, anymore. I'm just trying to defend my name. So, obviously, I'm not going to go on my way to dox people that I'm not very involved with. Um, and 12-year-old scissoring on my phone. That's cra- that's quite the crazy claim. I'd love to see something substantiate that one. <laughs> but, like, 
Bro, yeah, yeah, Seth has 10 gigabytes of child porn. Uh, he showed me on kick in 2014, <laughs> like, and then people were like, oh my god, Seth is the devil. <laughs> like, that's how they respond. They just, like, <laughs> they just fucking believe it. <laughs> I don't, like, I don't, are people just that, like, retarded? Like, <laughs> and then, I don't know. I don't know, this shit's crazy, though, man. Like, <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, like, it was a pretty entertaining week, definitely stressful, do not want to do it again, but it's something that happened, and we're gonna remember this, I don't think, I don't think my job has ever been this hard, like, ever, like, I, I think the hardest it's ever been was during the, um, I'd say, like, the Broly Wars thing, and that's about it. But at least with the Broly Wars, when I was, like, up and, like, arguing with, like, a thousand people, like, I was doing it for fucking fun. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Shit, dude. Seth doxed my grandma. Yeah, legit, dude. <laughs> you could probably tell people that and they'd believe you, like. Yeah, and then, like, when the, the victim, quote-unquote, like, told her story, like, everyone was just, like, noticing how her story was, like, inconsistent when she was telling it, like. She was just saying weird shit, like, uh, I have, I have no intent of persuading you guys, I'm just trying to tell you the story, and then she was, like, just, like, ranting with pure rhetoric for, like, three minutes, like, and people would just, like, call her out for it, or how we, how certain things happened, it just wasn't consistent when she was getting trialed, maybe she was, like, nervous or something, but, like, dude, people are not believing anything, which I'm very glad for, I'm tired of this shit, I'm tired of all these groups of fucking people, but... Who knows? I, I think I just dealt with the I just dealt with the four horsemen of the fucking uh, social media influencer apocalypse. I, is there any others? Is there like a fifth horseman? What's the fifth horseman? What's the fifth horseman? I think that's all of them, right? Slander, racism, pedophilia and doxing. What's the fifth one? Oh, sexism, maybe. Maybe sexism? I don't know. Oh, oh, right. Yeah, yeah. Like some Islamophobia or something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, those are like my four horsemen, I guess. Then Maybe there's a few other ones. You're famous now? Yeah, dude, I'm getting... Bro, by the way... Yeah, homophobia. That's true. That's true. That whole thing. Yeah, essay. Yeah, all that kind of stuff, I guess. I guess there's a lot of things you can get, like, uh, dealt with for, but I feel like, um, I definitely feel like the pedophile one is, like, the strongest one, but racism's pretty up there, too. But, like, it's, it's just crazy to me that, like, people will be on, um, like, I'm gonna turn some music on, by the way. I, maybe we don't need music, I don't know. But it's just crazy to me that, like, people will be on that fucking platform like swatting people and like doxing them and like weird shit like that and not like not like doxing like oh i found his instagram you know like doxing as in like they log into their fucking account with like some kind of like just like an image or like get all their passwords and shit and then drop their fucking private information and all their dms or something like like, that kind of docs. Like, they'll, like, log them or swat them or it's just with weirdest shit or be, like, or literally get exposed for wanting just to slander or ruin someone's career or they'll make fake screenshots. Like, not even if just, like, the whole, like, screenshot thing, not even just of me. Apparently, like, other people were having, like, fake screenshots made of them and shit. And I was like, damn, dude, these people are, like, weird. Like, <laughs> these aren't, like, normal people. Oh, yeah, let's turn on, like, the what's, – what's a good, like, chill Dark Souls theme? What's a good chill Dark Souls theme? Like, the main menu of one? I don't know. What's a chill Dark Souls? I don't want, like, a hype one right now. Because I'm not... Because this is kind of, like, post-war shit. No, Gwen... <laughs> Gwen is, like, depressing, isn't it? <laughs> isn't Gwen depressing? <laughs> yeah. Dark Souls 3 Firelink. By the way, it's going to be a little bit loud. Wait, hold on. Let me turn this down. Yeah, Dark Souls 3 Firelink is kind of chill, I guess. Let me, uh, okay, Let me turn it up a bit. Okay. 
Okay. <clears throat> Orphan of cost. Yes, not chill. Um, let's see. Whip the captain's ass. Bloodborne ambience. Yeah, yeah. Uh, another good one is like, um, like Silent Hill. Like Silent Hill um, ambience is really fucking good. Maybe we can do that instead. Silent Hill ambience. Although, like, Dark Souls... Dark Souls kind of fits the whole, like, background of, like, the evil fucking... <laughs> Shit, whatever. So, whatever. We'll just listen to this. Anyway. So, like... Yeah, I don't know. Dark Souls fits better. Let's go with that. Okay. <laughs> I'm walking on sunshine. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Man, I should be a singer. I'm fucking... <laughs> so, like, I'll say this, though. After this, I'm feeling very confident. I don't really think that there's anything they can slander or try to ruin me with anymore. I think it's pretty much just over. Um, so that's good. We survived the great invasion. Uh, hopefully, I kind of feel like... I kind of feel like this is um, us moving into, like, a different arc. You know, like... Maybe it's time to grow up and move past Discord and start focusing on more, like, productive things, maybe. Um, like, I'm not, like, a... I don't, like, debate anymore. Like, I'm still good at it. But I don't do that anymore, so I don't need to be on Discord for recordings. Um, I don't need to be involved with anybody. Um, and I just did it for fun, so... Maybe this is just like, okay, Seth takes on all of his old, ancient enemies... And then moves on and grows the fuck up. Who knows? <laughs> but, yeah, Seth Next Generations. I don't know, maybe the next pro tag will be named Beth. Who knows, dude? <laughs> yeah, except for some rat debates here and there. Yeah, maybe. Other than that, I think it's just time to move on. Um, and we we did all our stuff. Like, I'm still gonna be streaming, making YouTube videos and whatever. But time to leave Discord behind after that one. Like, whew, my God, we dropped the 900 man call, destroyed every enemy. What's left? What's even left at this point? Do you think you're still the best debater? I mean, like, I can't... I can't, like, verify that. Because I haven't been debating. But from what I can tell... I'd say the hierarchy hasn't really changed. I'd say, if anything... I hate talking about debating because it's kind of getting cringy. But, like, if I had to say... I'd say debaters have gotten worse. Not better. Like, the new, the next, the new generation of debaters are, like packers and doxers you know they're not like high highly you know optimized argumentative machines you know what i mean they're more it's kind of like it's just more immature it's not really like a there's not that much finesse with debating anymore so do i think i'm still the best very likely <laughs> like very likely and i hate to say that like i hate to sound egotistical but if the new meta of debating is packing and doxing then and i was the best during the rhetoric era then i'm probably still the best <laughs> you know what i mean um the seth mongo is better true haha <laughs> The Boruto generation, yeah. They're using, like, weird, like, anti... Bro, the next generation has anti-ninjutsu and shit. Like, <laughs> it's, like, fake. <laughs> Let's say you are not the best in their meta. Right, I'm not the best in their meta. That's a good way to put it. I guess I'm not the best packer or doxer. <laughs> you are correct. Maybe I'm just have a boomer way of doing it these days. Too outdated. A little archaic, maybe. 
<laughs> I like the Seth anime dub better. Not the best pedophile. Damn, you're fucked up, man. After everything we've been through. Yeah, I'm a Gen 1-er. This filler was shit, to be honest. Four wars in one short filler arc, <laughs> right? What a, If this was a filler arc, this was crazy. I want to know what the main arc is like. Yo, by the way... um. By the way, that Death Note video, I told y'all. I told y'all, dude. I was like, look, it's going to be a slow grower because it's a Death Note video, but it will blow up. Now look at it, bro. We got, like, all of these verified YouTubers on it. Even Tearzu watched that shit. I was like, Tearzu? <laughs> you came back here? It's like, what the hell? That shit was a banger, dude. That shit banged. Now, I don't... I don't know. Goku vs. Saitama still has more views. Yeah, but it's a lot older, no? It's a lot older, no? Let me cheat. Let's see. Let me see. One week versus one month. So, something that'd be really interesting is if... Um, by the way, thank you guys so much for the um, sub goal. I appreciate it. Yeah, thank you, Westo. Um... Something that'd be really interesting would be if that Death Note video got more views than Goku vs. Saitama. Tell me that the times are not changing after that shit. You know what I mean? Seth the first Hokage? Pretty much. Pretty much. Came from the Warring States era. <laughs> And made the first village. <laughs> Are you hyped for Chainsaw Man? Uh, not really. But I'll give it a peep. Maybe it'll be good. Who do you think will lead the next generation? Uh, nobody. I don't think there will be a next generation. Um, I think it's, I think it's honestly gonna die. Which is sad. But, like, here's the problem, right? Like, um, everyone, like, everyone that's, like, good, whether it was, like, Trinity, Parrot, I, or really, like, anyone in that community, they just kind of, um, they're, like, gone. They all left. Or, like, Parrot, Parrot became, like, a timid shell of his former self and, like, hides in his server and like Trini like vanished like the avatar. And then I'm just out here just burning alive <laughs> as I try to deal with everything. <laughs> yeah. So like, I don't think there is anything else. Like there's no one left really. Like it's just kind of degrading more and more. It's like, bro, you ever play Dark Souls 3? It's like every time you link the flame, the world just degrades. Like, it's like that, bro. I think it's just time to go to Elden Ring. <laughs> like, I'm gonna be real. <laughs> like... <laughs> like, every, yeah, every debater is just becoming... I mean, like, maybe... I mean, like, okay. Debating, like, politics and real-world issues can always be relevant. But for there to be an advanced debate community around it and not just people debating about it is something totally different. Like, people will always debate Dragon Ball. People will always debate politics. But will there be an advanced, optimized debate community around it is the question. And I think it's dying, like, really bad, um, which sucks, but. It's just roast, yeah, it's just roast, doxing, personal shit, ad hominem, lots of nonsense. I mean, like, I have some debates I can upload, which people will probably watch. Like, people will still think it's entertaining, but, yeah, that shit's gonna, I don't know where it's gonna go. We'll see. Maybe, maybe the next Hokage will become from, like, TikTok or fucking MySpace or something, I don't know. Yeah, what is this? Hey, thank you so much. 25 subs? Yo, Reach, thank you so much, dude. I really appreciate it. I really appreciate it, man. That's so nice of you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You guys are the goats, for real. Like, I know I don't stream very often, but whenever I stream, you guys are so supportive and just nice. I mean, you guys aren't nice. 
Like, sometimes you guys will just sit there and roast me. But it's like, you guys have a nice side. And I'm, I'm glad that uh, you guys are so supportive for how much I neglect you. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. <laughs> for sure. Uh, <laughs> yeah, wholesome Seth moment. I mean, I just have to be, man. Like, And I'm not going to lie. I've been pretty stressed. Like... Like, what was it? Like, after the, uh, after, like, the week straight of fighting, like, I couldn't go to the gym for, like, two days. And it was weird. I've never actually been stressed before. Like, like that. Like, um, so, like, when, when I, even, like, just imagining, like, lifting a weight or going to the gym and, like, punching a mitt for, like, training, it just, like, mentally exhausted me. Like, it was, like, that kind of stress. It was crazy. Like, my brain was on overload. It was really weird. There were some days I'll stand up for like 24 hours, like planning on like, okay, how am I going to handle this? And just a crazy situation. Uh, I feel better now though. I took a two day break because I literally couldn't do anything. But uh, yeah, I feel pretty good now. Strong, could do whatever. Probably could do it again. <laughs> Not that I want to, but I could probably do it again. <laughs> yeah. Yep, thank you, thank you. I mean, like, dude, like, everyone's gonna be stressed after a fucking week straight of fighting, like, numerous groups of people. Like, it's just not... And it's not like, oh, he's just debating them. It's like, no, dude, he's like... He's like drama-ing them. <laughs> like, they're trying to ruin his life. You know, it's like, not like... It's not like normal, like, beef. You know, I'm okay with normal beef, but... That kind of shit's always so fucking dumb. Yeah, I had a rest at the bonfire after that one. It was like kind of some kind of like super boss rush or something. <laughs> yeah, doing better now. Feeling better. Pro hopefully I can get to the gym today. I'm feeling like it. My sleep schedule's getting back on track. Uh, so hopefully I can start my next video. Now, I'm kind of not sure what to do for my next video. I have a few topics in mind. <laughs> 